Good morning, neighborhood community. Good morning. So, I want to start off by um, wishing well to everybody in Florida, um, especially we know of one of our followers, Marketech Clevenger. Um, we hope you are uh, evacuated, or if you did not evacuate, that you are someplace safe. Uh, our hearts go out to everybody in Florida and everybody in the path of Irma. So, first off, that's what I wanted to say. <coughs> I'm still sick. Um, migraine and <clears throat> cough and all that lovely stuff. I still have a cough, too. Yeah. It hasn't gone away. I still have sinus issues and all that stuff. Yeah. I'm it's at crazy. the stage... <laughs> Um, Kevin was at one point all his joints and everything hurt and, um, yeah. I'm at that stage right now plus I'm having very bad kidney pains again and uh, I hope the heck I'm not having more kidney stones um, it just started this morning so I don't know what that's all <clears> about <throat> but anyway I'm going to be watching um the last of season seven of The Walking Dead before season eight starts in October. And just coloring or relaxing. And what are you gonna do today, baby? I am gonna go on a insecticide attack. I have to go to Home Depot, I figure. See what I can do about getting rid of these ants. They're everywhere now. So, I've run out of exterior ant poison, so I figured I need to go to Home Depot. So, I still have some credit there. And, um, spray the entire exterior of the house. And see what I can come up with to do, to work on the inside that's not going to harm the animals. And it's not going to make Val sick. And that's hard, too, to get both of them at the same time. Because we did have a, um, a insecticide for the interior that was uh, based on peppermint oil that kills ants but it doesn't kill animals obviously but it, it the smell is just it's too much for me I couldn't <sighs> handle it it's pretty strong very strong smelling and it's a mess and after you use it you have to clean it up and so that's probably what I need to do today uh, again I say the same things I, if I uh, feel well enough I will probably mow the lawn because it's gotten so bit tall out there and uh, that's my Saturday yeah. alrighty so the first order of business today is going to be Home Depot um, see what I can do as far as uh, uh, ant killers uh, I really need to find something that is going to be safe for the animals on the inside because uh, just putting out the, uh, the baits is not working anymore. So I'm going to have to actually do an attack on these guys. So I'll look for some interior and exterior. I'll spray the entire exterior. And I have some things that I need to pick up at the store. <coughs> I still have my cough not want to go away so whatever this cold is it lingers all right so here's Halloween at Walmart now not as good as it used to be at least the skeletons are getting better bought something to put my crown back on and that's in pretty bad shape I'm assuming that the hole in the crown is actually still attached to my tooth although I haven't actually been able to see it so my biggest concern of Val's gonna have to help me is I don't know which way the tooth goes on and I can't reach into my mouth with these two stumpy fingers so she's gonna have to help me with this so I'm gonna wash these first and I've got some glue. It's 
called Dent Temp. I don't know how temporary it's going to be. That's what I'm going to do. Watch me glue my fingers in your mouth. <laughs> don't glue your fingers in my mouth. Ooh, what fun! We get to watch Kevin brush his his tooth crown. And he's using my toothbrush. <laughs> no wonder why we both get sick. <laughs> <laughs> Okay, Kevin brushed his teeth and brushed his crown. Now I get to stick, I gotta wash my hands. So I washed my yeah. hands and then I picked up some kitty litter and, and picked my nose on the way back. Is that okay? <laughs> I don't think I'll let you near me ever again. <laughs> it... Just, am I filming that this part? Open your mouth wide. Is it go on the top or bottom, first of all? Top? Oh, okay, I see where it goes. Okay. All okay, right. do you think you can get yeah. it on the first? So let's put glue on No, it. let me try first. <sighs> Want me to hold the camera while you root around in my mouth? Does that feel right? Yeah, take it back out. I'm afraid it might get stuck. All okay, right. so Kevin's now applying the glue to the two, to the crown. All right. <sighs> Here we go, applying the glue. Ugh, this doesn't want to go on. Very small amounts. It doesn't want to stick. It's like gum. There we go, now it's going. All right. The glue has been applied. <laughs> I have taken the tooth. And I am now entering the tooth into the mouth. How does the tooth feel in the mouth? A little tight, but I think I'll survive. It might loosen up once the glue dries. <laughs> What are you, Attenborough? Doing? I am commentating this whole adventure. All right, feels a little high, but does that taco taste good? Do you want that cat Angel taco? is eating the cat taco. Angel, 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 Angel. <laughs> How is that cat taco taste? Well, you do have something on your shirt. Okay, besides gluing my teeth back together, I think I want to do one more thing before I call it a day today. I have this palm tree growing right through the middle of my sprinkler setup and faucet and everything, and it is going to bust it right out of the ground pretty soon. And I keep forgetting about it and not doing anything about it, but I have to deal with that now. So what I need to do is pull out my sawzall and just cut that sucker out and hopefully I won't cut any of the lines here. So I got my sawzall out with a big old blade on the end and I am going to cut this sucker out.
So yes, I did actually cut right into the pipe, but in my defense, this is the entire palm tree completely encircling it. So it's going to be a lot harder than I thought it was going to be. I hope I can take it out without causing too much damage. Alright, so this thing has been, it's completely grown around my water supply here. I even have root bowl on the other side. That's all root bowl over there. So I'm not quite sure how much work is it going to be. It's going to be quite a bit. And I've run out of gas. So, and I have to get this water back on because these four, five sprinkler system is, on, is for the hillside. And uh, I don't want that to dry up. But right now, <sighs> I'm tired. I'm sweating like a pig. It's been kind of a long day. I, I think I got a lot done. Um, some of it is ongoing, like the uh, faucet over here. Right, Boomer? There's Boomer hiding behind the uh, little palm. So I still have to deal with that later. <clears throat> Freckles in the tall grass. So I'm uh, barbecuing some hamburgers right now for Val and I. And uh, we'll just probably end up watching a movie later on today. You're just taking this opportunity to see what's in what I may have dropped in my lap, aren't you? <laughs> of course. So. Crazy, crazy. So, y'all saw Kevin explode the pipe outside. Shh, shh. Well, you have to what tell them mean? about shush, that. Shush, shush, they I saw was, it. I was going to delete that all out. Well, you're not deleting it now. Oh, man. You better leave it in there. So, um, we've heard that there's companies that will come and take pump palm trees see if we can um if anybody out there knows of any companies that do do that that do do that they, they grow like weeds in our yard yeah we, we have got, palm trees like crazy that we need dug up and taken out of here about 10 or 15 growing in our backyard yeah and heck if there's a company that'll pay us money to come and take them away then Please. Please, come take them away. Okay, we'll start. We'll come go. and take them away. <laughs> <laughs> I'm what getting in think? the Halloween spirit. Oh, guys. yeah. Sorry. See, look, I got my kitty cat. Uh -huh. The Halloween kitty cat nighty on. This is September. First weeks of September is always the beginning of the Halloween season for us. <laughs> and um, uh, we're probably not going to do the Halloween marathon today, but we are watching the first Halloween. <laughs> anyway, <laughs> we're going to go ahead. And, can I help you with something? Yes, we're getting ready. Your party's coming up. It's coming. Don't worry. We're going to go ahead and call it an evening. So if you liked a little bit of something that you may have seen in our video today, please give us a favorite. Share our video with your family and friends. Please leave us a comment down below. But most <laughs> of all, please subscribe. And we will see you all tomorrow. Ta-ta for now. Goodbye. I love you. We're gonna watch Halloween. Oh, this is, and we got a teacher. Happy Halloween! No? Happy Halloween! Happy Halloween! Happy Halloween! We'll work on that one. Almost. <laughs>